Hello everybody at 5 over here. And this is basically, um, you know, I said in one of the most recent, one of my most recent videos, the first video I had face cam, that I really wanted to, um, start doing other stuff on the channel. And, you know, TLD thought that was a pretty sweet idea, and as you can see, he already put out his first little rendition of a vlog thing. It was more kind of like a life story sort of thing, like get to know me a little bit better. And I'm sorry that there's glare on my glasses. There's like no way I could ever fix that. Actually, hold on, I may be able to do a little bit more about it. Ah, that's still not very good. And sorry for my bad quality freaking webcam. I really wanted this view, otherwise I would have used face cam. Not face cam, but uh, flip cam. But for this, you know, it doesn't even doesn't matter. Oh, I'm wearing my Liberty Baptist Church shirt. <sighs> anyway, might as well get on to it because it's already freaking boring. Weird bugs outside my house making noise. Anyway, for those of you that don't know, even though you should know, my name is Caleb with a K. And <laughs> I, oh, for the record, I already tried to do this whole video once, but the audio on it was really crappy, so I decided to redo it just for you people. It was half an hour of me sitting here talking. Anyway, and a lot of people don't can't remember that my name is spelled with a K. They always want to put a C on it. Even my family sometimes forgets, and it's kind of funny because I even have, you know, picture books, scrapbooks, whatever, from my grandmother where she spelled my name, like, with a C or... Like, with a bunch of stupid letters. And I even told this chick my name was Caleb. I was like, hey, okay, girl. Because we were writing names down in class. This was last year, freshman year. Listen to this. I was like, my name is Caleb. K-A-L-E-B. And she wrote down Kelby. K-E-L-B-Y. And I'm like, Ugh. like, what? How do you how do you do that? How do you suck that bad at freaking English and hearing? I just, I don't know. So now I'm Kelby, I guess. Oh well. Oh, I got But um. Okay. Well, let's see. Talking about school. Because I'll tell you about kind of like my family life, and and kind of like my school sort of like career, I guess. Since like I can't, it's really hard for me to talk about those at the same time. I wouldn't. I don't really know how to talk about that. But, uh, anyway, okay, so, for, well, I guess I can go ahead and say that, uh, up until I was five, well, I've always lived in some, no, that's not true, um, well, I was born in Somerset, Kentucky, and that's where I live right now, um, for five years I lived in this one house with mom and dad, but then, when I was five, my mother passed away, uh, from a heart attack, and, uh, and then, during my, when I was five, I went to a Christian academy, or maybe when I was four, and, uh, for the record, at Christian academies, they are freaking strict, and they go freaking sweet Jesus of Christ on you, because they freaking pwned my butt every day, like spanking me and stuff, and that freaking sucks. I always want to tilt my head like this, but then I look on camera, and it shows my head's tilted, so, I need to freaking straighten up, yo. I don't even care. Anyway, so, yeah, Christian Academy, they freaking uh, demolish your anus. And, uh, let's see, and then, after my mother passed away, uh, we had to move. I moved in with my mom and dad's parents, my nana and granddad. They're freaking great. And we live with them, and I start going to Science Hill Independent School, and I go there for, and I move with them once, like, my dad, like, we live with my nana and granddad, but then my nana and granddad decided to build another house, so we moved there, and we moved to Science Hill, and so, but I'd already been going to Science Hill, because I was in, like, the Science Hill district, I think, I don't know, they may have been paying for me to go, it's an independent school, you have to be, like, in the district to go for free or something, or maybe to go at all, I don't even, I think this, but, so I'm going to Science Hill, and then I move, actually, in Science Hill, and I'm going there, K, and I went there, K through 4th, and I made, like, freaking a bunch of friends, and, like, knew everybody, and I was like, this is freaking great, and, uh, well, uh, that's 4th grade, about, I think it was, like, the summer in between 3rd and 4th grade, 
my dad meets this other woman. Oh, wait, I said I wasn't going to do family at the same time. Yeah, so I'll do that in a minute. But anyway, so all the way through fourth grade. And then um, I, I moved to public school, uh, Pulaski Elementary School for fifth grade. And, uh, of course, I, like, lose all my friends and crap, so I'm, like, freaking depressed as freaking all get out, and I was, like, sad to move and everything. And then in fifth grade, um, right off the bat, like, I sort of made some friends in my homeroom class, <clears throat> and then we were, like, split into groups to go into classes, and I had some friends, just a few, and I met Connor in my homeroom, and I was, like, kind of, like, half friends with him, I guess. I mean, it was just kind of one of those things where it's, like, you talk to them in that one, like, little place and it's like that homeroom friend or something anyway um and then and then they decided to base the groups off math scores and the only way I can like I, I guess I'm just gonna have to say that I'm pretty pretty good at at the ac academic stuff I don't know <laughs> and uh so I was put into the highest group in there group four there's four of them and um well there but so I'm put in there and then, um, and, the, and then, like, a couple days later, well, I've seen, like, Ryan in there. I saw Ryan. Well, I didn't really know what his name was. I didn't know anybody in there. They were, like, all new. I was with stupid kids originally, but then they decided to be cool and freaking do something. But, uh, so I see Ryan there, and, I, and, like, I talked to him once, and I was like, this guy knows what's up. He's the best. And if, I'm talking about Momja here, if you don't know already, his name's Ryan. Anyway, so, I'm talking to Ryan, we become freaking friends, and then I also talk to this girl named Brianna, and this girl named Erin, and then we all sort of make it like a little freaking four-man cell of a friend group. We're like BFFs forever. And I eventually start liking Brianna, and Ryan also likes Brianna, but then Erin likes me, and it's just a huge freaking circle, and, and, uh, and TLD didn't even go to Pulaski. He went to Woodstock, which is like a two-man school or something. But that's where my dad went, so can't even freaking say anything because my dad's a freaking genius. So, and then, you know, fifth grade went by, and I was still, you know, friends with Aaron and Brianna and all that stuff. And then, you know, we get to middle school, and it's, like, different. And then Brianna is stupid. She, like, she was so cool in fifth grade in like fifth grade hold on there's like somebody on xbox wanting to like try and talk to me check him out anyway like brianna was so cool and i was like girl i'm marry you hardcore one day but then she's just freaking stupid she's gotten stupider like over the years i swear to god uh oh yeah she's like really stupid now hopefully she sees this and knows how i feel about her oh and she's smoking hot or she was i don't know there's, 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 so I was like, how's this girl even friends? But anyway, she's stupid, never talking about her again. So we're uh, in sixth grade, me and Ryan are still, you know, freaking, like, best friends, hardcore. And then Ryan starts having all these classes with this kid named Josh. And so I'm like, whoa, okay. And then Ryan introduces me, because they become friends, and they have all these classes. And I'm like, hey, Josh, what's freaking rolling, bro? So we become friends. And I still, like, have a bunch of classes with Connor, so I become even better friends with him become like better friends with you know a bunch of people like Steven and um which is gyroscopes uh I think Evan never ice on OX OX live um I don't know I think Mark too I'm not sure but uh I still don't even know Logan or TLD like I can't even recall seeing him at all in sixth grade I couldn't even pinpoint one time I saw him. Um, so I go through all that. And we, like, have this huge table at lunch where we all sit. And it's, like, the bossest thing ever. Cause we, but then a bunch of people, like, always would invade and, like, freaking make all of us sit other places. And it's, like, really stupid. But for the most part, we all had this really sweet table at lunch. And we all sat there. I only had, like, one class with Ryan, but still retained, like, a, a maximum friendship. It was amazing. Oh, uh, so then we get through sixth grade, seventh grade comes along, and, you know, basically kind of same story, except I have a few more classes with Ryan and Josh and stuff, a few more classes with my friends, so that's pretty freaking great, 
still never met TLD except for this one little like social gathering get together thing that they hold for these people that have gold cards and have a gold card you gotta have like all like A's and B's on a roll and like no disciplinary freaking actions against I don't I don't know you gotta be a good kid I guess and so we go to this gold card social thing and Logan's there and Ryan, Ryan knows Logan because they had like classes in 6th grade and like 7th grade maybe, I don't know. No, wait, no, they didn't. <coughs> he was on a different team in 7th grade. So, all that crap happens. Um, and I finally meet TLD. And I'm just sitting there like quoting equals 3 and he thought it was great. And I was like, I'm ripping people off hardcore, but I'm stupid, so whatever. So I meet him, but I don't even know about him. And also... In seventh grade, that's when I got my Xbox. I didn't have like I didn't even intend to get Xbox Live. I didn't even know that that existed. Like online play, what? I always just screw up, freaking playing with my Pokemans or my Spider Man or something like that, like or my Super Smash Bros. Melee, which is like my best game or something. So I get Xbox and I get Halo, and I'm like, well, this is pretty sweet campaign. And then my friend Connor is like get Xbox Live, because he was, like, my best friend that had it, so I get it, and we're playing Halo Reach online, but periodically, he'd, like, leave me to go and do some other crap on some other game called Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, oh, yeah, I finally just realized you can see this little thing I'm talking to, that's my Turtle Beach mic that I'm talking into right now, but anyway, so he would always, like, leave to go play uh, MW2 with, like, Willis and some other people, and I'm, like, sweet, and Willis is all mezzy, mesmerized, and, um, so I eventually went and bought that game, and that's when the freaking COD sensation started, started, like, playing COD, I told all my friends to get it, oh, and the Kite Runner thing, um, okay, so Josh, I, we always used to freaking joke at him, he said he could run in the nighttime a lot better than the daytime, he said he was a lot faster at night, so I called him the Night Runner, we always used to freaking joke about it, and, uh, and I was gonna make my Xbox Live gamer tag night runner but i was talking to josh when i made it and he was like dude no that's my name you can't have it and i was like okay so what else can i do and well my name starts with a k so i was like kite runner fine with a k sure let's go so i made a kite runner kite runner was taken kite runner one two three four that's where that that's where i got that name and that's a pretty freaking lame way to get your name but oh well so i make my name yeah yeah, yeah. call of duty yeah yeah yeah, yeah. And, uh, then eventually, you know, everybody gets on Call of Duty and everything, you know, freaking Ryan and Josh and everybody, and they're all making their name Runner, and apparently we, like, have a clan now, which I'm the leader of, since I was the first one, of, since I made it, I guess I'm the leader. And, uh, eventually, uh, wait, no, that didn't happen yet, I don't think. Um, so, we're doing that all in 7th grade, and I got my Xbox, like, in September, like, near the beginning of 7th grade year. So that's like when I got live, and we're all doing that, you know, 7th grade, uh, and I already told you I met TLD, I met him like one other time, and it was like, we sold cookie dough, and uh, the people that sold the most got to go to this friggin' like little party thing, and I was like one of the top five sellers, I sold like over $100 worth or something. Bye.